morning guys it's thursday morning and um today is going to be a sewing day i've decided that it's pretty early still it's just now nine um i am not going to work today i am in fact taking the day off like eric suggested so um i'm gonna get some sewing in this morning it was nice to sleep in it's nice to get up just sit around walk the dog now it's time for another cup of coffee and to get cracking on this sewing stuff. I really would love to knock out Eric's um, shirt today for Adventure Time. And once I have this shirt pattern down, it's a really basic t-shirt pattern. I can make him t-shirts if I really want to. So that's super exciting. Um, I realized the other day when I was cutting out the neckband that I actually cut out the wrong thing. So I had to recut out this morning. And now I'm gonna set up a little sewing station here in this room because Eric is in the game room playing games. Actually, he's watching the vlog right now. And he didn't realize. I got super excited last night because he was like, talked about Domino, blah, blah, blah. He didn't know that that was what the theme of the vlog was. And I came across the guy I was sitting next to because I was waiting to watch <laughs> It was pretty bad. It was a good week. I suggested that Emma should relax for a little bit. Um, what time is it now? 9.20, she is about to sew. I have my sewing station set up. I have everything that I need, including my ironing board and my iron. This is a new way for me to set up, by the way. I've never set it up here before, but it worked the other day when I was trying to sew the curtains and I needed the curtains to not fall on the floor because they attract hair like crazy. But I'm gonna work on Eric's Adventure Time t-shirt today. Yay, Adventure Time. When she says she has everything she needs, Really what she was talking about was the cup of coffee. Yes, although it's decaf because I've already had one regular cup. Okay. So, I turned on the computer today. I know it's a new thing. And something showed up. Which I didn't realize it was happening today. But, season one is over on Overwatch. I am shocked. I didn't realize that it was today that it was ending. So thanks for playing season one. My season high was 44. My career high was 44. And it said I earned these icons. The player icon earned, the spray icon season one, and 20 competitive points. I thought you had to be in the top 500 um players in the world to get this spray so i really don't know if i earned this one that one let's see oh maybe it's just a regular spray maybe it's not the animated spray let's find out let's click continue let's go to career profile since it says something new player icons okay so i have that new player icon i have that player icon for season one let's equip that uh okay so new icons been equipped super cool but let's look at sprays uh the hero gallery we'll go to diva sprays i had oh i did get it the season one spray unlocked by completing season one placement matches okay but I don't think it's animated. Someone said it was supposed to be animated. Maybe animated was just for... Yes. Yes, see how this one's animated? That's pretty cool. So you unlock that one by reaching top 500 ranking during season one. Okay, so I wasn't top 500. But even though it's not animated, I still got a season one spray. All right, so straight from sewing headquarters over here, I have put the neckband in Eric's t-shirt. So check this out. It looks pretty t-shirty, which is good. Can you see that neckband? That's right. I sewed that in. Yep, this girl right here. This one, me. So I'm pretty pleased with myself. I think it looks pretty nice. I need to put the sleeves in and sew up the the sides and then put the hem on the bottom and then clean up the edges anything that it's jersey so it's curling I hate it 
I probably shouldn't use jersey in the future. I should use some sort of knit that isn't jersey. But we work with what we got. So I stopped playing Overwatch. Like I said, season one is over. I think season two starts in two or three weeks. Um, had some good games going on today, but I'm gonna take a break for a bit. I was just given a beta update to a secret gaming system that I'm not allowed to talk about. Um, so we're gonna test that out and see what version 4.0 of that new software looks like. Hmm. Check it out. I made a plain t-shirt. Super duper exciting. So the t-shirt is done. We've tried it on Eric twice now. It fits. The, sh the shoulders are a little on the low side. They're kind of like how this t-shirt is like, or not really. They're a little, they're a little low. So I know that if I make this pattern again, I should make the shoulders a little shorter. Eric is narrow. Um, and the sleeves need to be shortened tremendously. And the length needs to be shortened tremendously. So I should modify the pattern itself and not just guesstimate like I did this time. So the sleeves might be a little wonky. They're like maybe a centimeter different than they should be, but I fudged it at the end, whatever. I think it looks good on him, but let's uh, get him to try it on and find out. Hey, Eric. Yeah? Will you try on the t-shirt? It's done. Okay. How's it feel? Feels good. Oh, the sleeves still look wonky. I try my best. Let me see. Evidently, Eric just doesn't know how to put on a shirt. He or just needed- your neck is too wide, so that's why I kind of fish around in it. Don't stretch out the neck. That was the hardest part. Okay. So yeah, I think it, I think it looks fine now. Is it too short? I don't think so. No, I think it's fine. And your pants are gonna be very similar to those shorts you have on right now. Oh, cool. So, do you feel thin without the blue pants? I guess thin with one in. Thin with one in. <laughs> I married him for his humor. Really, I did. Oh my gosh. All right, I think it's officially lunchtime, which means Eric is gonna order Domino's. And I don't know what I'm gonna order, but I'm not having Domino's. I think once in a week is more than enough. For the first time, once again, in years. Really, I think the last time I had Domino's. Was two days ago? Before two days ago. Must have, did I ever have Domino's with you? Yes. Really? When we lived uh, at the other building. The other building. Mm -hmm. All right, so it's been three years, I'm gonna say. And now they have, what what is it called? Easy order where I can just text them an emoji and they will start making my pizza. Terrifying. But this is actually kind of cool. I'm gonna go pick it up because it's cheaper to pick up. It's cheaper to get a large and to pick it up than is to get a medium ordered and delivered. Ridiculous. But I'm sure a lot of you have used it before, but that's actually kind of interesting and cool. I place my order, they're prepping it now and soon it's gonna go into the oven. I think I'm video gamed out. I don't know. Now that there's no competitive mode to Overwatch, it, it, it's, it's hard to really have fun with it. You know, the, the regular play is fun, but I just feel like people aren't taking it seriously. Not, okay, seriously isn't the correct word to use but it's just not that much competition people aren't giving their all i don't know i don't know it just seemed more like oh just on there playing just for the sake of playing and i kind of like the whole competitiveness of it all okay so emily and will are coming over tomorrow for epic day of twilight imperium but we must food and drink them while they are here. Thus, I have gone to the grocery store to retrieve lunch meat for sandwiches and Eric is going to make bread later. 
or tomorrow, something like that. Uh, but we gotta go buy liquor because we're running scarily low on, on rum. Dexter doesn't get to go with us though. He can't go to the liquor store. He's just sad that we're leaving because we were just playing with him and he was so cute. He's like the cutest puppy in the entire world playing with his toys. So I don't feel so well. It could be because, not because I ran, but because I had dominoes. But I, I didn't feel bad afterwards. I actually felt bad, sick, after playing Adrift on the Vive. Woo, it was, it was intense and there was a lot of floating and fearing for my life due to suffocation. It was, I don't know, I played for maybe like a half hour or so, and I normally never have a problem playing in VR, but this game, whew, felt a little queasy afterwards. So I kind of just been relaxing for the past hour and a half. Emma just went out to get some food. I think I want some chicken and We'll see. Maybe we'll watch a movie. I don't know what we're gonna watch. But tomorrow, like Emma has said early, earlier, is Twilight Imperium with Emily and Will. I am so excited. All right. She, like I said, went to get food. We're going to watch a movie and I'm just gonna hydrate with some water. All right, until manana, I will talk to you guys later.